I had a chance to walk around and check out the East Downtown or the Edo area of Houston on a day when I was heading up to Tomball to play some music at Paradigm Brewing Company. East Downtown area of Houston is also called Edo and it's located just southeast of downtown. So you could see that downtown skyline pretty well from this area and it's not really that far of a walk, maybe 10 minutes, although I'm not sure if people actually do that walk or not. I do know that people pour into this area when the Houston Astros are playing. It's a popular hangout spot for after the game and even for watching the game I imagine it would be pretty fun here because Astros Stadium is not far from here and the Rocket Stadium is also not far away from here. And directly here in East Downtown, they have the Shell Energy Stadium, and that's where the soccer team plays. So this whole area has been under development. It's uh, known as being hip and cool and vibrant and fun and trendy, diverse, eclectic, and it might be approaching the Heights area of Houston as in terms of its coolness. So there's a lot of revitalized housing around here, like modern condos and lofts, townhomes. There's Victorian style homes and apartments. Although going around based on its uh, history, it does have an industrial look to this area and it does have some walkability to it. Although, and there's also access to the Metro and uh, even a bike trail that runs through. So the footage I've been showing here is of a little square along St. Emmanuel Street. And there's a lot of restaurants and clubs and live music opportunities around in this area. You can see the graffitis and the murals and uh, some art stuff around here, including some cool photogenic uh, things like the We Love Houston sign and the giant Beatles statues. This is where you can find those. In terms of live music, there are a couple breweries here that sometimes have live music. The first is Eighth Wonder Brewery, and then True Anomaly also sometimes has it. For more of a club scene, there's Chapman and Kirby and it gets really popular Sunday during the day on this kind of scene that they've built up here. You could see the footage that there's a lot of people hanging out waiting to get inside. Warehouse Live is a really big music event venue so they got big shows there and then the secret group is known for comedy so you can catch the Houston comedy scene there but they also have live music there as well and on this day they had music at the truck yard the truck yard is got a lot of shipping containers going about and a lot of outdoor seating they got a ferris wheel there and on this day John Egan was playing there in the shade so ultimately I had made it out to Tomball where I had the gig at Paradigm Brewing Company we were inside where it was nice and comfortable with the AC and they had a lot of good looking food going around there and a lot of nice looking uh, beers that they brew up. So I had a good time playing for all the folks hanging out here at Paradigm on this Sunday. Well, I was born in San Francisco. I was a farmer man. I got a farmer tan. Street shoe and paved in gold. I didn't make enough money to feed my soul. I met a girl down there in the Italian community We start a farm and we left right out of that city Well I was born in San Francisco I was a farmer man I got a farmer tan Street shoe and paid in gold I didn't make enough money to feed my soul Thanks for checking out this video. I post all about touring around Texas and the music scene of Texas. So be sure to click on my YouTube channel and check out all the videos I got. Find out what you're interested in watching to stay tuned on my posts here. Let me know in the comments what else I should be checking out. And thank you for your support.